Ciao, I'm Marianne Esposito. Today on Ciao Italia, we are traveling down to Sicily to make one fabulous, historic, and delicious lemon almond cake. Ciao, I'm Marianne Esposito. Welcome to Italy, and let's cook real Italian. Aren't they gorgeous? Swiss chard, I knew you said that. I'm in heaven. That's for you. Sunday sauce. All 20 regions of Italy are fabulous. And every time I do this, I think of my Nonna Galasso because she always made it this way. You want a Goldilocks dough, just right. Who doesn't like basil, especially in the summer? Obviously, you have to have pesto sauce at some point, right? I mean, I'm a cook. Why can't I try it? You're the best. No, you're the best. Let's go to Sicily for that, which is right here. So when life hands you lemons, oranges, almonds, swordfish, chickpeas, you know that we're in Sicily, the largest island in the Mediterranean and where half of my family comes from. So today, and they're right from there, right in the center, Caltanissetta, and I've been there many times. And you know what impresses me about Sicily? the beauty of the food, the freshness of it. And citrus plays a huge role in Sicilian cooking, not just in savory dishes, but in really sweet dishes. And today, I wanna make a very unusual lemon tart for you. This is something that really has an old, old history. You don't see this too much, so I'm gonna make it for you today. And to do it, we have to start with lemons. So we're going to boil three whole lemons. I'm gonna put them right in a pot of water, you bring the water to a boil, you cover, and you allow those lemons to cook for about 45 minutes to 50 minutes. You wanna start with large lemons because lemons in Sicily are as big as grapefruits, and they're much sweeter than our lemons. So we're gonna keep an eye on that. So we're gonna let that boil, and while those are boiling, we're gonna talk about almonds because almonds play a really big part in the cuisine of Sicily but also in this cake. So they become really the flower. So the almonds are the flower and when you're in Sicily in February you see all these beautiful almond trees that are in bloom with these beautiful pink flowers and what do Sicilians do with almonds? They have both sweet and bitter almonds. We only have sweet almonds. So we're gonna make an almond tart today. So we have to start with some almonds. So here we have some sliced almonds and I'm gonna put them into a food processor. So let me get those ready first. So we wanna pulverize these. So you do this in a food processor because this would be very difficult to do if you're doing it by hand. And you wanna pulse those up. You want to leave some texture, so that looks pretty good, see? It's kind of fine, but still has a little bit of texture. So we want to take this out, and you need for this recipe about two and three quarter cups of ground almonds. So there's our ground almonds. Put this back in because we're going to need this again. All right, so now that we have those ready, let me move this over here for a minute, we have to prepare our pan. We should do that really before we start cooking with the, uh, with the ingredients. So you want a nine inch spring form pan. See, it has a removable bottom. And now we want to butter that really well. So there is some butter that I put into the microwave, just melted it. And we wanna really grease that pan really well, all over. This is the kind of cake that is great for an afternoon tea. It's kind of dense, very dense tasting. And as I said, the, the, the lemons in Italy are much, much sweeter than ours. So what I've done with this recipe is 
adjust the amount of sugar that I added. So I added more sugar because our lemons tend to be much more sour than Sicilian lemons.